A rectangular piece of paper is folded at two corners as shown in the diagram below. The two shaded parts are identical. Find angle X. The first thing is to identify that the corner of a rectangle is 90 degrees. So this is where the 90 degrees is. And if you were to fold it up, the 90 degrees will be now over here. Likewise for this one here, this is the corner of a rectangle. If you were to fold it up, this is where the angle 90 degrees will be after it's folded. Next is to identify where the duplication of this 73 degrees is. So if you were to fold it up, this part here is also 73 degrees. So that's where the duplication is. And with that, we can find out this angle that I'm marking in green here. Uh, that will be 180 degrees take away 73 degrees times 2. And you will get 34 degrees. So this is 34 degrees and, and this angle in green here will also be 34 degrees because these two lines are equal as they mentioned that the two shaded parts are identical. So that is actually an isosceles triangle. So if this is also 34 degrees, we can find the angle that I'm going to mark in yellow here. Using angles in a triangle, we take 180 degrees, take away 34 degrees times 2 and you will get 112 degrees. Now we can find angle X by using angles at a point. Take 360 degrees, take away two sets of 90 degrees and 112 degrees to get 68 degrees as the answer for angle X.